This is not financial advice. I just hope you brought your oven mitts, baby. But don't invest in the companies that you don't understand and don't believe in. Because if they dip, you are not gonna buy the dip. And then you are gonna sell low and be right back here crying to me. And I'm not having that. So if you can't handle the heat of these hot stocks, to stay out of the kitchen and consider investing in the index funds. Now hit that like button, hit that notification bell. Let's get straight to the point and subscribe to the channel. Now let me know in the comments if you knocked it out the park with me, with Caster Maritime. I told you. Every time there's an acquisition of a new vessel, this one is taking off. You got to keep your eye out for that. And they just announced that they got two more down on the pipeline. And this one took off just like we always say. So now, let's get to the first banger on the list. And let me know in the comments if you hit that grand slam with me. That's when all of the bases is loaded. And you knocked it way out of the park, baby. That's not a 2X. That's a 3X. That's a 4X. That's a 5X. Let me know if you killed it with me. And let's get to the first banger on the list. And the first banger on the list is this. It's Galat. Satellite Networks, ticker symbol G-I-L-T. Now, this one has been down today. This one has been down today. And people saying, oh no, what's going on with that? What's going on with that? We've been in this place since it was $7 a share. So, if you want to hit the Patreon link and be up on the plays as soon as we are, you know what to do. Come to the private Discord. Also, what I want you to do while you're down there is hit the Weeble link so you can stop thinking the market closed at 4. So you can stop thinking the market closed at 6 because the market is still open. Now, let's talk about it. This is a 5G global network play and when you see red in the stock market this is a part of the game i told you you got to be a shark on the stock market when a shark see blood in the water what do they do bow they on it you got to be a shark when you see blood in the water aka red on the stock market you got to be ready to put that back fin to the top of the water and strike bow just like a shark now again today they got some news the news is this at 7.22 a.m., Seeking Alpha posted an article, and they said this, Jalot shipped its aero modem to Chinese airlines, and it will be used on their entire fleet for in-flight connectivity in a multi-million dollar deal. Now, keep in mind, even after this news, this thing fell down. You might be wondering why. This thing has been running up almost 200%. In the last month, it was due for a pullback. You know what a pullback is? It's a buying opportunity. When you see red, remember, you got to be a shark. You got to say, bam, I'm ready to strike. So now, what problem does this company solve? What problem does this company solve? Now, this company is a lot like Global Star that I talked about yesterday, except this one is more advanced. And I told you, never have brand loyalty for these companies. We got to have loyalty amongst each other. However, for these companies, they don't care about you. You don't need no loyalty to them. You can invest and diversify into both. Into both. Now, let's talk about it. This company gives people a chance to have very strong 5G internet connection, no matter where they are, on an airplane, on a ship, no matter where you are in the world, in a rural area, they do that. Now, and again, if you've had satellite TV before, like direct TV, you know the signal is trash as soon as it's bad weather. The clouds get in the way, whatever gets in the way. However, to combat that, they got satellites in multiple orbits and they got satellites that connect to towers on the ground, so they got you covered all around. So this is a really, really solid game plan, but again, Ask yourself, what are the big dogs doing with this information? And in the last two days alone, in the last two days alone, 11 large institutions loaded up on guilt stock, and one of them couldn't handle the heat and got up out of the kitchen. And ARK Invest is in this one. ARK Invest is in this one, which is one of the best performing ETFs of 2020, and already this year, they still killing it. But they bought 150,000 shares and have been quietly loading up on guilt stock all the way back since 2018, all the way up until like October 2020. Now, they've announced recently that they're working on an ARK X space index fund. So this could be part of the reason why they stopped investing space stuff into other ETFs that they have because they're working on seeing, hmm, what do we want to put into this ETF? Now, let's keep it going. How are we gonna play this one? We are gonna use not strike days, not strike to own. We are gonna use the strike price. So this is how we gonna do it. You got $300 for example, and remember, you are gonna scale this up or scale it back to whatever makes sense for you. Now strike price, AKA I strike when I see a price that I like. AKA I buy when I see a price that I like. If I got $300, I'm buying this between right now in 1899 the price may be different by the time you see this video but right now in 1899 i see that bow i'm putting my first hundred on that and if i see it pull back pull back to 1850 i'm putting my next hundred on that bow, bow. and then if i see it pull all the way back 
all the way back to 16. You may never see it pull back to 16. You may never see it pull back to 1850. But you want to be prepared or surprised. What are the five P's? Say it with me. Proper preparation prevents poor performance. Say it with me again. Proper preparation prevents poor performance. You want to be prepared or surprised. So if I see it pull back to 1850, I see it pull back to $16. I'm putting my last hundred on that. Bah, bah, bah. And then I'm riding this wave straight out to the promised land, baby. I see you there. And when are we getting out of this one? When are we getting out of this one? You got to consider. You got to consider that SpaceX, they're trying to IPO something called Starlink, which is basically the same thing, but it's going to have a lot of hype behind it. So if you want to get in this play and use the profits to invest into that, I totally understand. And ARK ETF or ARK X, when they come out with that, they might boost this one up if they add it into the portfolio. But even without it, this one is seeming like it got a lot of quality of being a high quality company. Now, next banger on the list, next banger on the list is Bio Nanogenomics, ticker symbol B N. G O and they got some news and we've been in this one since it was two dollars but again it's looking like we got an opportunity to catch it before it goes off now what happened today Yahoo Finance posted an article saying this Dr. James Broach of Penn State Institute demonstrated that the bio nanogenomics gene mapping tool is and listen to this uniquely capable of identifying solid tumors uniquely capable meaning it's the only thing that can do what it's doing and it is automated and it provides oncologists, aka the doctors who study this, it provides them the ability to prescribe optimal treatment. This thing is uniquely capable to give doctors a chance to give optimal treatment. That's a game changer if I ever heard one before. Now, and on top of that, BlackRock, the largest asset management company in the entire world, they found out what we already knew and they decided to get in. If you check my last videos on this, I was telling you, these big institutions, we got in before them and they blowing the price up for us. So shout out to them. And BlackRock got in and they're on file for February 5th. Now, how do we play this one? We not gonna do, we not gonna do any strike prices on this or we're not gonna do any strike days on this. We're gonna strike to own a specific amount of shares between 10 and 1,000 shares, depending on what you can do. Let me know in the comments how many of these you are striking to own. Now, what are the price targets on this? What does Wall Street think? And as recently as five days ago, Bio Nanogenomics received a price target for the first time of $15 a share. And it was by none other than five-star analyst from Wall Street, Kevin DeJeter. And he's representing the Oppenheimer Group. So now, Let's talk about it. What's the next banger on the list? And before we get into that, we got to do this. We getting out of this one. You got to hold on to it for at least three years, but preferably way longer than that. So next banger on the list. Next banger on the list. We need a long term hold, baby. We need a big dog. We need a big dog. You already know. It's the beast. It's the monster. It's the juggernaut. It's the shopping mall killer. Amazon. Amazon ticker symbol A M Z N. Now, I just don't have it in my heart to leave you uninformed. This is why Amazon is a trillion dollar company and this is a big dog, but this thing is growing like a little dog. We might have to start calling this one Clifford the Red Dog. So now, in nine days, the past nine days, Amazon has been getting crazy price targets. Crazy price targets. Why? Because they reported their $100 billion earnings quarter. That was absolutely crazy. Now, Keep in mind, they got 50% just about of the retail market share and they're expected to keep growing it, not letting go. They got the whole retail market in the chokehold. They putting shopping malls out of business. And let's see what Wall Street talking about. Wall Street, 31 stock analysts rated this one and it was unanimous across the board. Every single one of them said this was a strong buy and the price targets in the last nine days go up to as high as $5,200 a share. And let's talk about all of them. The first one on the low is $3,700 a share. The next one is $4,100 a share. And then the top one on top of that is $5,200 a share. So how do we play this one? No strike price. We're not waiting on a price. No strike days. This one ain't one that's gonna run from you like that. We gotta do strike to own a specific amount of shares. Now, don't get scared because the price is in a thousand, ten thousand, five thousand. Don't get scared of that. Consider buying fractional shares. This is why I always tell you to have multiple brokers. Some of them let you in the pre-market and some of them let you buy fractional shares. So strike to own a specific amount of shares. For example, set a goal for yourself to get between one third of a share of Amazon between there and 10 shares between one third of share and between 10 shares let me know in the comments which one you going with if not even better if not even less make it make sense for you and then when we get out of this one we getting out of this one as soon and i already told you as soon as people stop buying things on the internet we out to play but until then we keeping this one in the chokehold now next banger on the list is since sonic ticker symbol s e n 
S and we got in this in the dollar range. I already know we killed it with this one already. But people been asking me, is it too late to buy? Is it too late to buy? Remember, you gotta be a shark. You gotta be a shark. When you see the red, that's when you see the blood in the water. You put the back fin to the top of the water. It's time to strike. So now they gonna get their FDA approval for their glucose monitoring system and it's most likely gonna go through because it's just like the old one except the main feature that's different is this one lasts two times longer so two times longer you could basically count and just nothing is guaranteed in life don't ever get it twisted nothing is ever guaranteed but there's a high likelihood that this is gonna get passed so you might want to get in on the play do your own research before it runs up so now and run up even more it already ran but it might run up even more on the way to the new FDA approval. Everybody's been loading up because they want to get in before that. So how we gonna play this one? We're gonna use strike prices. So if I got $300, remember, this is just an example. Scale it up, scale it down. So now, if I got $300, this is how I'm hitting this one. First strike price, if I see this hit, $3.80, I'm striking there. Bow, I'm putting my first, between now and $3.80 actually. I'm striking, put my first 100 on that, bow. And then, if I see it pull back to $3.60, I'm hitting my next strike price and I'm putting my next hundred on that. Bow, bow. And then if I see it pull back to $3, I'm putting my last hundred on that. Bow, bow, bow. And then I'm riding this wave straight to the promised land, baby. And again, you may never see the second and third strike price, but if it starts to go up and you believe in the company, just keep buying in. And this is called averaging up. Now, we got a bonus. And when are we getting out of this one? At a minimum, put your trailing stop loss on this to protect some of your profits and to protect your original investment. But you wanna hold on to this one to a minimum until close to the FDA clearance or maybe even a little bit after it. So now, and then potentially this one is a really long-term hold, but we got a bonus, we got a bonus, and it's switchback energy, ticker symbol SBE. Now, they had a vote today, February 11th, and it was pushed back. It was pushed back. They were voting if they were gonna merge with ChargePoint, the charging station company, but you know what? It was pushed back to February 25th, so you might see this one going down a little bit or cooling off a little bit, but this gives you a chance to buy in if you wanna get in on the largest charging network in the entire world, in the entire nation. So now, after the bonus, let's get to the comment of the day. Comment of the day is this. And my guy says, my family has been poor as long as I can remember, but I'll leave out the depressing details. I wish I knew about investing earlier, but my family made it seem like a scam. And I'm tired of breaking my back at these jobs. So I started investing, but unfortunately, only with $200. Thank you for making it a bit easier for me. Wish me luck. And I want to salute you for seeing the opportunity on the stock market for what it is. A chance to get you the life that you deserve and get your family the generational wealth that they deserve due to all of your hard work, due to all of your research. And I got to let you down. I got to let you down. You want to know why? You asked me to wish you luck and I can't wish you luck. I'm gonna tell you why I can't wish you luck. It's cause you don't need it. You don't need luck. You know who needs luck? The people who are trying to hold you back. The people who are trying to hold you down. You know why? Cause you got too much fight in you, baby. You got way too much fight in you. You got too much willpower. You got too much determination. They can't hold you back. They the ones who gonna need luck. We gotta remember, this is a marathon. We trying to get to the promised land. And you know what? If they chop one of your legs off, then you just gonna hop there on one leg. You gonna get there though. And you know what? They chop the other leg off, I'm gonna be there and I'm gonna drag you all the way to the promised land with me, baby. We gonna get there together and what I want you to do if nothing else is remember luck runs out but willpower and determination could last a lifetime now other than that I want you to hit the patreon link and get in the private discord with us hit the weeble link so you can stop thinking the market close at six and if you can't handle the heat of these hot stocks then stay out of the kitchen and consider investing in the index funds I love y'all take care